गुड मॉर्निंग माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स सी एक्सरसाइज 3.6 फर्स्ट मेन फिफ्थ वन ऑलरेडी वी हैव सॉल्व फोर प्रॉब्लम्स देन सम ऑफ सम प्रॉब्लम्स आई हैव गिवन यू द होमवर्क आई डोंट नो हेदर यू हैव सॉल्व्ड आर नॉट बट आई विल कंटिन्यू अलोंग विद दोस होमवर्क व्हाट एवर आई हैव गिवन इन द प्रीवियस क्लासेस नाउ वो लेट अस मूव टू द फिफ्थ वन 7x 2y डिवाइडेड बाय xy इक्वल्स टू 5 एंड 8x plus 7y divided by xy equals to 15. Consider 7x minus 2y divided by xy equals to 5. Now this xy will refers to both the terms. So 7x divided by xy minus 2y divided by xy. Equals to five. X x cancels. Y y cancels. This becomes seven by y minus two by x equals to five. Now let one by y equals to p and one by x equals to q. Now what will become? This equation seven one by y that is seven p minus two one by x that is two q equals to five. This one is the equation first. Now and eight x plus seven y divided by x y equals to fifteen. Now, 8x divided by xy plus 7y divided by xy equals to 15. X x gets cancelled. Y y gets cancelled. 8 by y plus 7 by x equals to 15. Now, already we have considered 1 by y as p. 8p. 1 by x that is 7q equals to 15. Say equation 2. Solving 1 and 2. Let us write 1 and 2. 7p minus 2q equals to 5. Then 8p plus 7q equals to 15. Now let us multiply by the coefficient of q. 7 7s are 49p minus 7 2s are 14q. 7 5s are 35. Then 2 8s are 16p. Plus two seven zero fourteen q fifteen two zero thirty. Okay, by adding what happens? Fourteen q minus fourteen q plus fourteen q gets cancelled. So sixty five p equals to sixty five. So p equals to 65 divided by 65, one ja, one ja. Therefore, p equals to one. That is, p equals to one. Put p equals to. Put p equals to one in. Therefore, q equals to 
2 by 2, 2 on that, 2 on that, q equals to, this is also 1. So, p equals to 1, q equals to 1. Now, let us find the value of x. We know 1 by y equals to p. 1 by y equals to p means 1. Therefore, y equals to 1. 1 by x equals to q. Therefore, 1 by x equals to q. Therefore, 1 by x equals to q also 1. Therefore, x equals to 1. x equals to 1. y equals to 1. Are the solutions. See, this one is the sixth one. 6x plus 3y equals to 6xy. 2x plus 4y equals to 5xy. What we have to do? Here, we have to transfer the xy to the left side. Now, how it becomes? See? So what will 6x plus 3y divided by xy equals to 6. Now 6x by xy plus 3y by xy equals to 6. xx cancels, y y cancels. What happens? 6 by y plus 3 by x equals to 6. Now, let 1 by y equals to p, 1 by x equals to q. This becomes 6p plus 3q equals to 6. Okay? Let us simplify a little bit. That is 2p plus q divided equals to 6. Now, 2p plus q equals to 6 by 3. 3 1 the 3 2 the. So, 2p plus q equals to 2. This will be the first equation. So, next, 2x plus 4y equals to 5xy 2x plus 4y divided by xy equals to 5 2x by xy plus 4y by xy equals to 5 x, x gets cancelled, y, y gets cancelled this becomes 2 by y plus 4 by x equals to 5. Now we have already considered 1 by y equals to p. This becomes 2p plus 1 by x equals to 2. That is 4q equals to 5. 2p plus 4q equals to 5. This one is the second equation. Then solving 1 and 2. Two p plus q equals to two. Second one, two p plus four q equals to five. So by subtracting plus two p minus two p gets cancelled. There is minus three q equals to minus three. So, q equals to minus 3 divided by minus 3. 
to which will equal to 1 minus into minus plus q equals to 1. Now put q equals to 1 in 1. Okay, 2p plus q equals to 2, 2p plus q 1 equals to 2, 2p two equals to 2 minus 1, and then 2p equals to 2 minus 1, 1, p equals to 1 by 2, p equals to 1 by 2. Now let us find the value of x and y. 1 by y equals to p. So 1 by y equals to 1 by 2. Therefore, y, 1 the y, 2 on the 2, y equals to 2. Then 1 by x equals to q. 1 by x equals to value of q is 1. Therefore, x equals to 1. See the method of the solution. See now the seventh one. First mean all these questions are from first mean. Eh? See 10 divided by x plus y plus 2 divided by x minus y. Here the denominators are in binomials. Denominators in this case. So we have to consider uh, the x plus y as p or x minus y as one single term q like that. But uh, we should have to solve such problems carefully okay now consider ten divided by x plus one plus two divided by x minus one equals to four let one divided by x plus y equals to p 1 divided by x minus y equals to q. Now what will become this one? 10p plus 2q equals to 4. So 2, 5p plus q equals to 4. 5p plus q equals to 4 by 2. Now what will happen? 5p plus q equals to 2 1s are 2 2 za equals to 2. This one is the first equation. 5p plus q equals to 2. And 15 by x plus y minus 5 divided by x minus y equals to minus 2. Now, we have already considered 1 by x plus y as p. This one is 15p minus 5q equals to minus 2. 15p minus 5q equals to minus 2. Now, say this one as 2. Solve 1 and 2. Following 1 and 2, 5p plus q equals to 2, 15p minus 5q equals to minus 2. That will into 5 into 1. See 5 pi is 25p plus 5q equals to 10. 
देन फिफ्टीन पी माइनस फाइव टू इक्वल्स टू माइनस टू देन प्लस फाइव टू माइनस फाइव टू गेट्स कैंसल फोर्टी पी इक्वल्स टू एट पी इक्वल्स टू एट डिवाइडेड बाय फोर्टी एट वन जा एट फाइव जा देर फोर पी इक्वल्स टू वन बाय फाइव एट वन जा एट फाइव जा पी इक्वल्स टू वन बाय फाइव पुट p equals to one by five in in one that is five p plus q equals to two i into one by five plus q equals to two five five gets cancelled one remains. One plus q equals to two. Therefore, q equals to two minus one. Therefore, q equals to two minus one means one. So, p equals to one by pi. Q equals to one. Now, we know what we know. One divided by x plus y equals to p. Therefore, 1 divided by x plus y equals to p means 1 by 5. Therefore, cross multiply x plus y equals to 5 on the 5. This one is the third equation. Then, 1 divided by x minus y equals to q. 1 divided by x minus y equals to q. Therefore, 1 divided by x minus y equals to q. How much we got? 1. Therefore, by cross multiplication, x minus y equals to 1. This one is the fourth equation. Solving third and fourth, x plus y equals to pi, x minus y equals to 1. See, plus y minus y cancels by adding 2x equals to 6 x equals to 6 by 2 2 1s are 2 3s are therefore x equals to 3 put x equals to 3 in 1 in third that is x plus y equals to 5 so 3 plus y equals to 5 y equals to 5 minus 3 therefore y equals to 2 see in two times we have to solve the pair of linear equations with p and q as equation in that case with x and y as the uh, with x and y as the, the variables here p and q are the two variables here x and y are the two variables both are in the form of a pair of linear equations in two cases we have solved here we got the values of p and q there we got the values of x and y respectively so see such types of problems will carry three marks uh, three marks so, uh, solve carefully to get the, the exact answers.